Welcome, I'm Amy Alcorn, corporate chef at the Thermidor showroom in Chicago. Today I'm going to prepare a classic weekend breakfast favorite, the Dutch Baby. If you aren't familiar with it, a Dutch Baby is an oven-baked pancake served warm in a cast iron skillet with fruit and maple syrup. I'm going to add some cooked apples to this one that we'll prepare first on our induction cooktop. The Dutch Baby is a dish that is believed to have its roots in Germany, not the Netherlands as you would expect from the name. It's thought that the name Dutch is actually a mispronunciation of the word Deutsch, meaning German. Wherever it originates, it's simple, delicious, and a real showstopper when it comes out of the oven. I'll be using steam in convection mode at 400 degrees, which will give us a pre programmed amount of steam throughout the entire cooking process. The Dutch Baby has no leavening agent, such as baking soda or baking powder. So the dramatic rise in the pancake that we will see is generated by the high temperature in the oven plus the continuous steam. The pancake will fall somewhat when we remove it from the oven, but I think you'll still be pretty impressed. Let me get the oven ready. Steam and convection, 400 degrees. So we'll get started first by cooking our apples. I've already got the pan preheating. I'm going to put in four tablespoons of butter. Let that melt. And then I'm going to add our apples, as well as some light brown sugar, some cinnamon, and some cardamom. We're just going to let these cook until they get nice and soft. And then they'll become the base of our pancake. Brown sugar. Okay, and I'll just keep messing with this while it gets going. So, you may be surprised to find that cast iron works on induction, but it very definitely does. Any pan made from a ferrous metal will work just fine. To test your pots and pans, just see if a magnet will stick to them. These um, apples should take about six minutes to cook. All right, while those apples are heating, let's go ahead and make the pancake batter. I've got four eggs here, farm-raised, cage-free. Just gonna give those a good whisk. Gonna add a cup of milk. Gonna add three tablespoons of sugar, a teaspoon of vanilla, and a good pinch of salt. I'll whisk all this together. And now we'll add the flour. We want to get all the lumps out of this batter. We want it to be really nice and smooth when we pour it over our apples. So I'm going to really get after this. Okay, it looks like our apples are all ready. They're nice and soft. Our butter and our brown sugar are getting a nice little caramelization to them. So I'm going to turn the heat off and I'm going to pour the batter in here. Now, part of the reason that this recipe works is because we do need to pour the batter into a hot pan. So it starts cooking as soon as it goes in. Just pour that evenly all over the apples. And it's time to put it in the oven. And that pan is a little warmer than I'd like to touch with my bare hands. So, all right, steaming convection, 400 degrees, 20 minutes. And here it is, mountains of soft, 
pillowy pancake, crisp brown edges, soft spiced apples. What more could you want? I hope you and your family enjoy this beautiful dish at many meals. Thank you for joining me.